Hi, Rosalyn. Irina. Hi, Larry. How's everyone today? <laughs> Morning, Rina. Uh, yes, I did, Larry. I thought it was getting a bit out of control. <laughs> Hi, Joyce. Icky pies, uh. yeah, I would think so. So, um, so today we're gonna do some uh, movements that is more rhythmic. Uh, wow, Joy's not eating very good. <laughs> Hi, Sashi. Yeah, so as I was saying, um, we're gonna do some movement. Hi, Janet. That is more rhythmic. Uh, we're gonna do a cat and cow. We're gonna do some like circles and waves. Uh, some of this movement you all will be familiar with, but we're going to uh, try and emphasize and focus uh, it slightly differently the way we do it or the intention that we put behind the movements. And also, yeah, so it's more, it should be more uh, relaxing. Yeah. So the cat seems to know where the screen is or the camera is, they always go in front of the camera. So as I was saying, uh, yeah, so I'm going to do some movements on uh, our hands and knees. Uh, we're going to do some rolling. We're going to do some uh, movements against the wall. So a lot of this is very rhythmic in motion. So it will be, uh, it will be fun. So uh, have fun, just explore the movements. Uh, and yeah. And then it should, it should feel nice and loose after that or it should reduce your achiness a little bit. Okay, so let's start. We're going to start with your... Morning Sashi. We're going to start with your hands and your fingers. So what we're going to do... This will serve as a warm-up as well. <laughs> okay, so... Uh, Grab a uh, sit down, make yourself comfortable. So make sure, uh, ideally, maybe you have a cushion or something so that you're not slouching like this, right? Hi, Ma. <laughs> yes, the cat wants nothing to do with my mom, absolutely. <laughs> okay, so uh, we're gonna kind of like put your hands in this position, right? Okay, so what I want to feel is this. You're gonna stretch your fingers and your wrists. So, Keeping your fingers close together. 
we're just going to first try and use your right hand to push all the way to the left okay so notice that my left hand i'm trying to push it all the way in so it's like a nice curve and I press down with my right to get it to go here okay then I'm going to try and go the other way, push down. So you don't want you don't want any of the fingers to pop out like this, right? You want to try and push in and stretch the other way. Okay, so you should get a nice stretch on the fingers as well. Okay, so hold it there for a second or two. Then we're going to try and do it, stretch the other way again. It's almost like you see how my wrist kind of like slides up. I'm going to go here and here you feel a nice stretch so you want to really make sure that none of your fingers is popping up like this and you try and work hard to push it in almost like they are sticking together right? all the surface are in contact This way. Okay, so can you feel? So as you feel comfortable, as you find that you loosen up, what we're going to try to do is we're going to try to kind of like move in this way and this way. So it's starting to be a little bit faster, a little bit more rhythmic. And you can also try to keep it here. And let me move up this way. Okay, so we don't want this. Well, try try our best, right? So okay, so this way. And rest. How's that for everybody? Okay, so next thing I'm gonna do is this. Okay, so this is just to loosen up the wrist. We're gonna try to kind of shift your weight from side to side, right? Okay, so I'm gonna sit further away so you can see. So I just want you to sit and kind of like feel that your left buttocks is lifted off the floor. So I'm sitting on my right. And I'm going to lift up my left, uh, right buttocks and sit on my left okay, so I'm just kind of like shifting sideways <laughs> I will be interested to see how Sashi does this okay, so see that, I shift my weight to the left I shift my weight to the right see that? So you should feel one of the hips hike up and then the obliques, right, the muscles on the side working. So just start with that. So don't be too rigid, right? Relax, let the body kind of sway from side to side. Okay, you ready? That was okay, right? Now I'm going to incorporate the hands that we just did. So watch me first. I like this. Yeah, I think this is really fun. So, the hands are going to come out of this. So, we did this, right? So, now I do is as I, as you go this way, okay, I'm going to kind of like go here. Okay. So, as I, my hand twists this way, if my fingers point to the left, my left buttock comes up. As it points to the right, my right buttock comes up. Okay. Okay. 
allow the shoulders to move. Everybody okay? Getting a hang of it? I lose, I lose it there a little bit. Okay? But you find like there's a rhythm, like almost like as I go here. Can you feel? Like you're kind of like moving yourself from side to side like this. Okay? Okay, so next one. We are going to move uh, front and back. So you're going to look like this. So hands are here. So what I imagine is like there's a... Almost like there's a stick right here, invisible. And you're just trying to let your fingers go underneath and over. So I'm going to go like, imagine the stick here. I'm just going to go here. Okay, so... Allow the shoulder blade to move, so I'm going to go See that? So, fingers It's like you're diving in Up Allow the spine to come in and play together. Can you feel? Can you feel how the fingers, the wrists and the shoulders, they are all connected as you do this? A few more. And rest. Everybody still okay? Are your wrists and your shoulders and your spine nice and loose now? Okay. So uh, the next move, we're gonna kind of move in a circular motion, right? So what I do is this. <laughs> okay. I'm gonna get you into a kneeling position like this. Okay, if you're not comfortable, you can take some cushions. And sit down. Okay, now we're going to start the wrist action. Okay, so, your hands are like this. Crunch your, kind of like, close together your fist. So, you're going to move then one over the other. See that? Okay, if I move the other direction. It's almost like you're... I mean, there's this wire, right? And you're trying to coil them in. Okay, let's try. Okay, allow the wrist to almost like rotating around each other, right? Moving in both directions. Everybody still okay? And rest. Okay, we're going to include the shoulders in this now. Okay, so remember. So, here. So, I'm going to move my shoulders. This way, I'm going to roll. Roll my right shoulder up, left shoulder down, and back. So, allow my weight to shift from one hip to the other. Eh? It looks like this from the side. This is a good warm up for those of you that goes dancing. 
or your Zumba, right? Okay, so let the ribs rotate. It's almost like you're drawing a figure, like, yeah, a circle, right, on, on this side, so like this. Okay, so notice that as I go, my wrist, the action that we did just now, comes in, right? Keep going. Everybody still okay? Is it moving or not? Yes. <laughs> Was that fun? Okay. So we are going to uh, next get on our hand and knees. We're gonna do something that you're familiar with, your cat and cat, your cat cow movements, right? Uh, but we're gonna emphasize it slightly differently. So go a little bit further away from here. So first, I'm going to now rock back to whatever is comfortable for you, right? Okay, everyone will offer a bit different. So from here. I'm going to start to flex my spine so my hands are in front I'm going to press my hands down I'm going to start to round then once I'm here I'm going to try to start to arch Around. As the weight goes to the hands, I start to arch. Okay, so you try to let the spine articulate. Oh, my cat wants to make a guest appearance. <laughs> okay. And relax. Okay, can you feel the articulation of the spine? Now, we could to play with your, okay, your fingers involved as well. So I'm going to get you to come back to this kneeling position like this, right? Okay, or, the, or if you can't kneel because of your knees, um, having a cushion and sitting down. Okay. It's fine, it's fine as well. So you're gonna do the wave, right? Like what you just did. With the hands, you're gonna cut like. Again. <laughs> the cat and cow poses, you're right, Joyce. <laughs> eh? So. So I'm gonna cut like. Hands goes this way, now, up. So I dive in, I scoop up, I round my back. to stand up right you can use the wall if you have or rather it's like well everybody will have a wall but if you're near the wall so okay so um i posted a video the other day in chinese for my clients uh, for the people that are 
um, they find a lot of these exercises too difficult and just a lot of like, exercises with the shoulders and balance against the wall. Um, there's a lot of value in that. So the wall helps to keep us moving in a particular direction uh, or particular planes. Okay, yeah. so we're gonna walk, walk a little bit with the wall today uh, on this. And as well as we are going to, yeah, we're just going to try and move around the, sh the, the shoulders and make circles, right? With your, with your joints. Okay, so the first one, we're gonna start you off with this, right? Now, you stand close to the wall. And then you're going to kind of like take a step away. Okay? Now, I want you to imagine your buttocks is a giant um, paintbrush or marker or whatever, and the wall is a whiteboard. Okay? Now, I want you to draw a circle with your buttocks. Okay? So put your attention to your buttocks. Watch me. I'm going to Start from the bottom, I'm going to go draw to the left, come up. I hope you can see. I'm going to shift that. Okay, again. So, okay, one more time here. I'm going to squat down a little bit, shift to the left, draw a circle. Now, the whole time, my entire foot, my heel, the ball of my foot, right, they stay on the floor. Okay? They don't come off the floor, but I'm shifting my weight. So again. And I'm going to go the other way. Okay, got it? Now, let's set a timer. We are going to do this for one minute in each direction. Okay? Ten? Okay, ready? And we go. So, whichever way you want to start with first. Make sure it's pain free. Your circle don't have to be big. You can also make it small. I hope your shots is clean. <laughs> I hope my shots is clean. Okay, it is. Okay, and, and time. Okay, well done. Okay, now we're going to move the other direction, right? So you feel that maybe the spine around the waist, the hips, it gets a bit of a um, stretch, right? And that's good because sometimes we, we always think of movements like this, like this, like this. We never um, move the spine, our body, our joint in a circular motion, but they, they are meant to be able to shift this way. Okay, now I'm gonna draw the other direction. Oh, who put a set face? <laughs> okay. Ready? There you go. So draw the other way. My kids was asking me the other time why I was moving like this so sexily.
Hã? Mais velho, né? É. Hein? So. Next, uh, we're gonna work a little bit on your shoulders. Now, uh, I got this idea from well, some of this I was inspired by this um, coach furry. So he was talking about like swinging, swing the Indian club, right? And there's this hardship move that we do that's really good for the shoulders. And actually, the move in itself without the club is very uh, beneficial for the, the, the shoulders and the spine. So we're going to do that, right? We're going to do it with the wall. So what I need to do first is this. You stand face close to the wall. So you're going to start with one hand at a time. So you don't want to be completely like against the wall, but just some distance away. So what you do, you're going to first start with your wrist movement. So watch my wrist, right? My palms are open. I'm going to turn my wrist in without bending my elbow. Swipe it down. So my palms, now my thumb's facing down, out, right? Um, down, sorry. See that, right? I turn it in. And up. See that? Down. Up. No elbow uh, bending. So just think about trying to draw a circle with my fingers against the wall. Okay? We're going to try that for 30 seconds. Okay, ready? And go. Okay, so here. Down, I draw a circle with my fingers. I'm up. Without my elbows bending. Okay, then of course move the other direction. Let's do a few more. And everybody okay? Next we're gonna move the shoulder, uh, the elbow joint. So moving from the uh, wrist to the elbow. So here, same thing. Watch me, right? I'm going to turn my hands down this way. Uh, start from here, thumbs up. I'm gonna draw. So my elbow is my, cent is my, circum uh, my uh, center, right? I'm going to come in this way. Thumbs down. So I'm going to go up. Okay, go in and up. Okay, ready? Okay, there we go. Here, thumbs up. Swipe it in. Almost like wiping my face, right? Out. Feel the um, shoulder articulating. The shoulder blade. And let's move the other direction, in and out. Okay, do a few more. And rest. Okay, last one. Okay, now we're going to move your shoulder joint. Okay, so I'm going to ask you to stay here. So think about you're using an elbow to draw a circle. So let me go here this way. I'm gonna come come in here, almost like letting my hand, my forearm right touch my ear, and out. So circle. Then reverse.
Got it? Yeah, you ready? And we go. So maybe just about five each direction. One, two, three, four, five. In the other way. One, two, three, four, five. And rest. Okay, maybe five is a bit too little. Okay. So we're gonna do the same thing. With your left hand now, right? Okay, same thing. You, okay, to try and see if you can see my left hand. So here, I'm going to just articulate my wrist. So here, I'm going to draw a circle without bending my elbow. Here. Okay, get it? Ready? Sorry, ah. Uh. Okay, ready? And go. So, draw a circle of your wrist. Put thumb down. And then try the other direction without bending the elbow. So now the next joint, we take it to the elbow. You're going to rotate around the elbow. Okay, ready? Let's do five each direction. So you come palms up, right? I'm going to swipe it in, down, and the palms up. One more. In reverse, one, two, three, four, just nice, five, okay? Next is the shoulder, okay, drawing the circle, okay, ready, and go, okay, so draw a circle in, Then come up to the ear, two, three, four, five, and the other way around, five, four, three, two, one. Okay. Now, we are going to combine the two hands together. So they look, they're going to look like this. So watch me, right? Okay, so it's, I'm going to turn both hands in. This way, we did this, right? And then I'm going to come up. Okay, so it's like swinging the club. So let me show you here. So it looks like this. Here. Hands in. Okay, you can make a fist if you find it's easier. So here. Yeah. Okay, ready? I'm gonna try it for 30 seconds. Okay. Ready? Here we go. So think tall. Reach your hands up. Okay, last move. 
This will be for the thighs. Okay, and so it's a bit like a squat that you did just now. So what you do is imagine your nose. Uh, it's the marker. Your stance is going to be wider. Okay. So my feet are actually wider. And I'm going to draw a circle with my nose. So it looks like this, right? I'm going to go here, shift my weight to the left, down. And reverse. See that? Okay. So imagine your nose as the marker and you're trying to draw a circle. So basically it looks like this from the front, right? I'm just kind of going down here. Got it? Okay, we're going to try this just for 30 seconds. Okay, ready? And we go. Okay. Draw both direction. You can go slow. Now you shouldn't hurt your joints. Okay, let's do a few more. And last one. And rest. Okay. And um, that's it for today. So, how was it for everyone? Was it difficult? Was it um, very abstract? Was it fun? Uh, more engaging for you to, to do it this way? Like getting acquainted with like all the wrists, uh, the joints, moving in a circular motion and working together. Um, let me know, right? Uh, give me feedback. Let me know what you think about the class, so they can work on it and just um, try to vary as much as possible so you benefit you guys. Okay. If there's no questions, then uh, have a great weekend with your family. See you guys on Monday. <laughs> yeah, it is quite tiring. Especially for the shoulders, right? Like making circles. Thank you, Sashi. You okay? So I'm sorry if some of you, your pants or shorts are dirty and you just dirty your wall. I hope your spouse uh, won't get angry with you. Okay, mine is clean, so I'm safe. Okay? See you, to, uh, see you on Monday. Bye-bye.